The arrest of a former Bridgeport priest has come as a big shock to those who knew him. The former Monsignor is accused of being part of a drug ring that was selling meth. News 8's Stephanie Simone has more on what the Bridgeport Diocese had to say about the arrest. As a priest, folks came to 61-year-old Kevin Wallen in despair. But you never think it's the person you know. We spoke to him two years ago when two Bridgeport firefighters died. But now police say addicts also sought his help looking for drugs. The parish obviously is reacting with sadness and hurt and some difficulty. A federal grand jury indicted the former Roman Catholic priest and four others saying they shipped methamphetamines from California to Connecticut from September to January. Then they're accused of selling them to undercover agents. Police say evidence includes wiretaps and surveillance. People are, are entering into deep and fervent prayer for him and for us and, and that's always a good thing. The Diocese of Bridgeport says Wallen resigned from St. Augustine's in June of 2011 for health and personal issues, and they hope to move the parish forward from this. We're here to bring healing and to help people to grow in the relationship with God, and likewise, therefore, in the relationship with the community at large. If found guilty, he could face a minimum of 10 years in prison. In Bridgeport, Stephanie Simone, News 8.